I've been on a date with one of Joni's other friends last year and nothing ever materialized for that date. I feel like he's going through one long midlife crisis. We spoke with one of Joni's close friends, Courtney, who is also a former softball teammate and was coached by you. Right. Uh, she says that you made a few gestures that were a little creepy yeah. towards her. So but we didn't go on a date, Courtney and I. All she did, she came over one day to, to, um, to, to, do, to talk to me for something. And then uh, she's like, yeah, I'm, I, I'm single now. And I said, I'm single too. I said, maybe we should go on a date one night. And she said no or said something to the fact that well, she Well, here's what to. she had to say, actually. Yeah. I had heard rumors that David was hitting on some of the other girls that we played softball with, but I didn't ever think that I would be one of those girls that he would hit on because he was like a second dad to me. He was never super blunt about it. He would text me and ask me if like how I was doing, and he'd be like, well, can I book you a massage and blah, 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 which was kind of off. So no, I didn't go on a date with her, and I didn't. Did you try? I, I asked her one, one day we should go on a date, and she declined, and so I never tried again. Yeah. Is there a boundary in there where you know this is awkward for my daughter, this makes her feel uncomfortable, and so there's a boundary here where I'm just not going to, I'm not, not going to play around in, in this arena here. I'm yeah, going yeah. to keep it private. I'm going to keep it away from her just out of respect for not yeah. her not feeling awkward. You have the right to do it. You're an adult. You, right. you can do what you want. But I'm just asking as a dad, yeah. does is there a boundary there that says this this puts her in an uncomfortable position? Yes, I agree. There, there should be a boundary there to to not date her friends or. But you you see that now, but you yeah. didn't see it then. Well, well, I did see it then, but it but uh, I know at the moment Courtney was was single, and she did mention that she was single, and I was single at the time too. Yeah. And then had, you took another softball friend to Mexico with Gina. Yeah, yeah, we did. So we're up now to four or five. But we weren't on a date, though. You just went to Mexico together. Yeah, yeah but... It was, it was her birthday. It was but, her birthday, but she had friends out there already. It's about boundaries, you know? Absolutely, I it's agree. It's about boundaries. I, it's I not a matter of how you got there. So, it's, it's about her looking at pictures of you with her friends yeah. somewhere else. She says Gina was one of her besties, but all of that changed after a boy came between them. Actually, a grown man, Joni's dad. Gina getting pregnant by my dad was like a punch in the gut. Gina says she was going to make your dad her sugar daddy. Did you think she was joking? Yeah. People would be like, oh, you're sick. You're dating your friend's dad. Why your daughter's friends? She was single, and I was single at the time, too. It's about boundaries. New Dr. Phil. Well, hey there. Thanks so much for watching. And while I have you, do you have a story or a question for me? If so, I do want to hear from you. Click on the link in the description and tell me what's going on. You just might end up right here with me on the show. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. Click that little red button below. You know you want to. What are you waiting for? Do it!